So welcome to Antolts, one of the great venues on the Biathlon World Cup Tour. Now the locals in Vera and Vitozzi have decided to go uh, in Group 1. They want to be early. The French are later. Who is right? Big shoot for Heike Gross, clear on the first prone, and this will give her the lead. <laughs> so Switzerland back to the top. Julia Simon. One of many people's list to win the overall this year. She's down in sixth, but she is climbing up through the rankings, or she was until Oberhof. Had a couple of ropey races there, 10th and 13th. This is a good start from Julie Simon. Have a look at the time, 15 seconds inside. A little bit of a way to go. She was a couple of seconds down coming into the range, but Simon will be close enough uh, to count as a challenger as she exits. She's got the green light. We have a new leader after the first shoot. She is 48 clear of Vera. So if it's a reasonably quick shoot and all five go on, uh, go down, she could well go back to the top of the table. Three out of three, four out of four. She's looking solid again. Fantastic performance from Heike Gross. Julie Simon. Is this going to be a first career win for Heike Gross? Good. Oh, my <laughs> goodness. Jean Monod, five out of five. Lovely shoot. So, Julia Simon is up into fourth. It's disciplined. Good. Excellent. My goodness, she broke the position quickly after that last shot. Well, that is an astonishing performance from Heike Gross. She goes to the top of the table. Eight second advantage over Arna Clive. And suddenly it's gone. Ah. Suddenly it's gone. The altitude here as you ski into this range, it is taxing. This is good oh. from Julie Simon. It was so nearly challenging. Vanessa Voigt uh, has been right up the top of the leaderboard all the way through. She's going to be the second athlete in to have cleared all the targets. The fans appreciating that as she goes for the line, but she will not get that win. Jomino into the last shoot, down That's in sixth good. place, 40 fast, four seconds behind. Last time we saw Simon, she was 21 seconds down on the race leader. She has had an incredible run when you think she came out of the range and she was 43. She's more than half that deficit and this could be worth a second place from Julie Simon despite the two misses. Couple of meters to go, 20 seconds, an unbelievable final two and a half K. Jamanou of France, two wins to her name this year. Is she going on the podium here in Antolz? It's close, it's close, she's done it. A brilliant final lap ski, 31.4.